everyone. It's Saturday, April the 27th, 2024. I am Doug. It is time once again to play Wordle. The weekend is here, and Andrea Van Hofken writes in, starting word suggestion, Scion. Very interesting word. Lots of great letters in here. Scion, S-C-I-O-N. Uh, let's not waste any time and get into it here. What do we get with Scion. We get, oh, nothing, unfortunate, unfortunate. It was a fantastic starting word, though, so absolutely no regrets whatsoever on this. Uh, but we will take an open board here, and we can do anything we want. Uh, oh, you know what I really like looking at this here? How about the word later? Five super quality letters that we can use here. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and go with it. Is the answer to today's puzzle later? <laughs> No, it's not, but look at that. L, A, and E, all in position. Not bad at all, if I do say so myself. Um, enough here that I feel like I want to kind of, you know, uh, move the letters around, see if we can't figure it out. I'll tell you what immediately jumped off the page of me when I saw this. Moving the E, L, and the A here. Now, obviously, I'm looking at it now, and I realize, relax, but we can't do that because we tested the R. But what I was actually thinking about was the word delay, D-E-L-A-Y. That seems compelling to me. We'll, we'll get some more intel on the E, L, and A. And, you know, this is quite possibly a good a good fit here. It could be the answer. So I think, I think I'm going to go with that. Uh, let's find out. Is the answer to today's puzzle the word delay? No, no, it's not. But we did get the A figured out. The A is now in position. That E and the L still evades us. Hmm, interesting, interesting. Um, I don't think the E is going to be at the end in any world. Uh, I never like to put the vowels in front. I have a mental block with the head. Um, so that leaves me to thinking about perhaps uh, L-E-A in the middle. So you have something like gleam would be a very real possibility. Um, plead won't work. We tested the D. But Gleam is compelling to me because G and M are some pretty solid letters. And if it's not Gleam, well, so here, here we go. If it's not Gleam, we're guaranteed to find the place for the L because there's only two places left. If it's not Gleam, we're pretty much guaranteed to find the E because I'm almost 100% sure it's not going to be at the end. So if it's not Gleam, we walk into the fifth guess with three letters locked in at minimum. So I feel really good about that. Um, okay, you know, I, I'm not as scared as I should be right now. <laughs> so we're going to go with Gleam is our fourth guess. Uh, let's find out. Is the answer to today's puzzle the word Gleam? Yes, it is. Ah, like a gleam in my eye, the puzzle solution. Uh, again, you know, we've the second time this week we've seen that where uh, those letters just frustratingly won't find their spots several guesses in. Yeah, but the other, the flip side of that is there's not too many different places you can look for. Uh, and so you tend to have some pretty good luck on the fourth guess in a situation like that. And we did today. Tomorrow is Sunday. We're going to start a new week, and we're going to start it in a big way by having a big dance. That's right. <laughs> we're going to have a dance, starting with the word dance. Well, I'm not going to be dancing, but hey, you're welcome to dance if you'd like. And more importantly, you're welcome to join me tomorrow as we play some more Wordle.